All right, Pistons fans, so in today's video, we got some new news in terms of the NBA draft. So apparently the Houston Rockets are aggressively trying to get the first overall pick. They're trying to trade up. I'm going to put the images on the screen here. Apparently, they're also uh, talking about some Eric Gordon trade scenarios with the Houston Rockets. And it's also reported that the Rockets are in love with Kay Cunningham. Now, let's get into this, man. So I made a video about Avery Johnson, the CBS analyst, um, a few weeks ago. And Rockets fans were very, very angry with me. And they were talking about, there's no way we trade up to number one. We don't want Kay Cunningham. We're in love with Jalen Green. You know, we're not trading up. We're happy with our guy. Jalen Green is better than Kay Cunningham. That's what all the Rockets fans were telling me in that video. You can go look in the comment section. Even right now, I made that video like a week ago. Even right now, they're still in my comment section talking about how they love Jalen Green over at Kay Cunningham, how they don't want to trade up to number one. We're taking Kay to number two. They were saying all that. And now this new report comes out and it's basically saying that the Rockets are in love with Kay Cunningham and that the Rockets are trying to trade up to number one to draft Kay Cunningham. Now, again, any reports, they can be fake. They can just be, you know, rumors trying to get clips for whatever website. But for now, let's just run with this idea that the Rockets are heavily um, aggressive and trying to trade up for this first overall pick. I'm just going to say it's not happening, um, Rockets fans. K. Cunningham is going to be a Detroit Piston. It's, I mean, there's nothing more to say. He's going to be a Detroit Piston. K. Cunningham is a player who has great three-point shooting ability. He's a good playmaker. He's a good leader. He has a nice handle. He can score the basketball. He's a solid defender as well. Yes, he does have his faults. He can't have too many turnovers on occasion. He can have bad defensive plays on occasion where he'll allow backdoor screens and off ball screens he won't see coming. He'll have some bad defensive plays as well. So he's not a perfect player, but overall, Kay Cunningham, for the most part, has the full package. Now, when you look at Jalen Green, again, no offense to Jalen Green, he could end up being one of the best scorers in the NBA, okay? He could lead the league in scoring one day, possibly. But Jalen Green currently is a streaky guy. He may improve on that in the future, but right now, he's a streaky guy, and he doesn't play any defense. He has all the offensive tools, but on defense, he doesn't have it there, and he's also pretty inconsistent. So when I'm comparing the two players right now, I have to go with Kay Cunningham over Jalen Green. Kay Cunningham makes his teammates better, and is solid on his own, whereas Jalen Green mainly plays for himself and doesn't make anyone better. So Cade is the guy. And now it's obvious to me if these reports are true that Cade is the guy because the Rockets are trying to trade up for number one. They believe that Cade Cunningham is better than Jalen Green. So Cade is the guy, but unfortunately for you Rockets fans, it's not happening. Fortunately for my Pistons, it is happening for us. We are taking Cade Cunningham number one. You're getting Jalen Green at number two. Especially for this Pistons roster, it really fits us. If you're not, if if you're a Rockets fan and you don't really understand, it really fits us Pistons because we have guys like Sadiq Bey on the roster. We have Jeremy Grant. We have Killian Hayes. We have Isaiah Stewart. We have guys on this roster who can play well with Cade Cunningham and fit with Cade Cunningham. And then I think it would actually be beneficial for your Rockets to bring in someone like Jalen Green. Someone who's just going to go there, score the basketball with Kevin Porter Jr. and grow with Kevin Porter Jr. Yes, it would be cool to ask someone like Cade Cunningham who will make everyone better. But for your Rockets in the current position that your team is in right now, you guys are just starting your rebuild. Yes, adding Kay Cunningham would be cool, but first and foremost, it's unrealistic because the Pistons are not trading down to number two. And secondly, I feel like it's just going to be beneficial for Jalen Green to come there and just score the basketball right now. So all in all, man, um, this is pretty hilarious to me, actually. I love when I first seen this news. I was very, very happy. I love seeing this, man. We are in a catbird seat right now as Pistons fans. We have all the power in the world. We're like Thanos with the Infinity Gauntlet. We have all the power, man. K. Cunningham is our guy. He's going to come here. He's going to make all of our players better. And he's going to help us get back to the playoffs, possibly championships one day. Who knows? But Pistons fans and Rockets fans, I feel like in this video, I, I gave, you know, good points for both sides. So let me know how y'all feel in the comment section below. Like this video, comment on this video, share this video. Thank y'all for 2K. And I'm out.